Hello everyone and welcome to Texas Wesleyan University. My name is Josh and I'm going to be your tour guide today. I am in the business school. I am a computer information systems major and I actually went to TCC and got my business associates there. Would anybody like any water? Just kidding. Let's head out. Hello and welcome to the Martin University Center. Right now I'm standing in front of the help desk. They can help you with any questions you have about campus. Directly across from me, we have our university bookstore, which has all your class textbooks, as well as Texas Wesleyan merchandise. They also do online ordering for textbooks. Over this way, we have our coffee bar, and you can get your fix when it's open. And now we're gonna go check out Gina's Cafe. Behind me, we have Gina's Cafe, which has some on-campus dining options for students. The last bay on the corner is a witch wish. Get your own sandwiches any way you want. Next to that, we have Premier Pies, which is a personal pizza place. Next to that, we have Zoka, which is fresh Mexican flavors. They serve breakfast burritos, breakfast tacos, as well as bowls of different kind of rice and beans and stuff in the afternoon. Um, now, I'm gonna show you the gaming and student lounges we have in this building. All right, now we're standing in our gaming lounge here in the Martin University Center. We have a table tennis table so you can play with your friends, as well as a big TV so you can hook up a video game console and play games with your friends there as well. Now we're gonna go check out the student lounge. Now we're in our student lounge. This is in the heart of campus, so it's a great place to study in between classes. It's also great for commuters who need to charge any of their devices. There's outlets all over the place. Now if you follow me, I'll talk about some of the things we have upstairs. Now, let me talk about a couple of the different resources we have upstairs. There is our 300 seat ballroom, which houses different events on campus, as well as the Division of Student Affairs office, which you can get more information about student life and housing. We also have the Career Services office, which can help you build your resume, as well as perform mock interviews to help prepare you for your next job opportunity. All right, now we're standing outside in front of the Canifax Clock Tower. This was built in 2015 as a part of the $36 million Rosedale Renaissance Project. This also brought to us the United Methodist Conference Center across the street here, as well as it moved the Counseling Center across the street, which is a part of your tuition as a student. Also, we have a restaurant down the street. It's called Ben's Triple B's. It stands for biscuits, burgers, and brews. And when you're 21, you can enjoy all three of those things. Now, if you follow me, we're gonna go check out the business school. All right, now we're standing in the lobby of the business school here at Texas Wesleyan. Here we offer five different majors for undergrads. We have general business, accounting, finance, marketing, and management. It's also home to our 100% online MBA program. A big reason that the business school is our largest school at Texas Wesleyan is our accreditation. We are accredited through the AACSB, which just means we're in a part of the top 5% of business schools in the world. Now, if you follow me, I'll tell you why our motto in the business school is networking starts now. So this is one of our successes, always training walls. There's one of these walls in every single school here at Texas Wesleyan. All it is is a wall of alumni who have graduated from Texas Wesleyan, and you can actually talk to them and reach out to them through career services and ask them questions about their career after graduating. An important statistic is that 84% of students who have graduated are either continuing their education or are working within six months. Now, if you look at this board, we have some of the different clubs and organizations within the business school. We have Finance Club, Accounting Society, and Enactus Club. Enactus is our entrepreneurship club, and they work actually directly with local businesses to help them prosper. All right, now we're standing in the Morton Fitness Center, which is the general fitness facility here at Texas Wesleyan. Every student can come here, you just need your student ID to check in. We have cardio equipment as well as weight machines, and over here we have a lot of our free weights and cable machines and squat racks. There's also a classroom where you can take different classes for credit or just for fun. Now we're gonna go talk about eSports. So through this door, we have our eSports organization. We're competitive in a couple of games, including FIFA, Overwatch, League of Legends, and Hearthstone. And even if you're not a competitive player, we encourage you to come join and check out the eSports organization. All right, so now we're standing in front of the Polytechnic United Methodist Church here on campus. We were actually founded by the Methodist Church all the way back in 1890. Inside, you'll find a couple different department offices, as well as our food pantry and chapel. 
We have a religious course requirement here at Texas Wesleyan, and we offer those in this building, such as world religions, comparative religions, and Old Testament and New Testament studies. Now we're going to go check out the Sid Richardson Athletic Center. All right, now we're standing in the Sid Richardson Athletic Center, which houses all of our athletic departments here at Texas Wesleyan. Behind me, you'll have our trophy case, where we have many national championships, but we actually have the most national championships in table tennis. Now we're gonna go check out the pool and talk a little bit about scuba diving here on campus. All right, now we're standing in the pool area. So unfortunately, we don't have a swimming or diving team here on campus, but what the pool allows us to do is have scuba diving as a minor. And if you minor in scuba diving, you can actually graduate underwater, get finned and pinned as a part of a unique ceremony only here at Texas Wesleyan. So now we're standing in our gymnasium. Here at Texas Wesleyan, we have men and women's basketball, volleyball, table tennis, and wrestling. And we recently just got our football team back. And the story is, there was this little thing called World War II, and all of our old football team was drafted. So they went on a 75-year hiatus, and now they're back, and we're glad to support them. So now we're standing in our state-of-the-art athletic weight room here at Texas Wesleyan. This is for all the student athletes, which actually one in four students at Texas Wesleyan are student athletes, and they all get to use this facility. Follow me to the next stop. All right, welcome to our athletic training room. This is where our athletic trainers can help students rehabilitate injury and help get you back in the game. All right, so now I'm standing next to a statue of our mascot, who is Willie the Ram. Willie was actually a real ram that would walk around campus back in the day, and it's rumored that when he passed away, he was cremated, and the ashes were used in this statue. So it's tradition around here to rub the horns for good luck. Now we're gonna go check out the West Library. All right, so now we're standing in the West Library. Over to my left, we have our circulation desk, which will help you find any books we currently have in the library. Over to my left, we have the reference desk, which will help you navigate any of the databases available to you as a student. Now we're going to go check out the Academic Advising Office and the Academic Success Center. So through these doors, we have our Academic Advising Center, where academic advisors will help you plan your schedule, as well as ensure that you graduate in four years. Across the way here, we have our Academic Success Center, which is basically our tutoring center, where student workers can help you do well in classes that you may be struggling in. All right, so all the computers you'll see in the library are available for students to use. On the second floor, there's actually classrooms that students can rent and use for bigger study spaces. And the third floor has plenty of seats, couches, and lounge chairs for you to take a nap in as it's our designated quiet floor. Now I'm gonna pass it off to Lexi, who's gonna show you a little bit about Dora's, our on-campus dining hall. Hi, Miss Anna, how are you? Hi, how are you? Doing great. Hey guys, welcome to Doors Dining Hall. My name is Lexi and today I'm going to show you all the different stations here. Doors was recently renovated a couple years ago and over here we have our hotline station. They serve a bunch of different home cooked style meals and if you go a little farther back you also have the burger bar. That's one of my favorites. You can make your own burger. They taste amazing. We also have our dessert station. It looks like today they have blue and gold cake which is one of my favorites. And over here we have our salad bar. In addition to salads, they also have soup, pizza, wraps, sandwiches, you name it, they have it for you. There's another thing I want to show you and that's in the back and that is our baked potato station. Come with me. This is also our ice cream cone station. I like to grab an ice cream cone on the way to class. They have different kinds of flavors, it's great. And this is our baked potato station. They like to switch it up. One day they might do tacos, another day quesadillas, it depends. We also have our drink stations over here. And this is our cereal bar. Um, they also have different kinds of milk, salads for you, cereals for you. And this is our little bagel station. So these are all the different parts of doors. I'm gonna go grab something to eat. Hope to see you guys in the fall.
Well, I hope he got full from Dora's. Now, Nikita is going to show you inside Stella, which is our freshman residence hall. Hi, welcome to Stella Russell Hall. My name's Nikita, and I'm going to show you around this building today. Let's start. All right. So we're going to start with our community space right here. We have a game room. I have a pool table in the lounge. Hey, Dexter, what's up? We also have a sports court outside. I don't know if you can see it, but students like to hang out, host some events out there. We have a lounge area if you want to sit and watch TV, read the table tennis table as well, and the community kitchen space. Usually that's where we just use the uh, microwave to pop some popcorn and make some <coughs> breakfast during the weekends. Uh, it's also a cool space for our freshman students to come in and uh, hang out, make some new friends, build a community. Uh, the Stella Russell Hall is also a residence hall that hosts around 90 room, houses about 120 to 150 students. It's a great community space for our students coming in, trying to make some new friends, be involved in the residence hall as well as the campus community. So I'm gonna take you and show you one of our rooms today. It's a double bedroom. We have two twin beds and I'm sure you're gonna love it. All right, so right here, this is one of the bed, uh, beds in the bedroom. We have two desks. You can sit and study, read, just chill by yourself, hang out with friends. Uh, we do have two closet space as well as some shelf spaces, some, uh, we have a sink here as well if you want to uh, start your morning fresh and bright. And uh, I've lived here in the residence hall for four years. It's been one of the best experiences of my college career. I hope you come in and join us here in Stella and uh, we'll see you in the fall. Rams up. So throughout campus, you might notice these large yellow security poles. These are just call boxes to campus security, but it's also recommended that you put their phone number in your phone as an emergency contact. Now to the next stop. So behind me is Dan Wagner Hall, which is officially the School of Education here at Texas Wesleyan. We offer a variety of majors for anyone who's interested in teaching, as well as this is where Exercise Science Department is housed. The School of Education offers our co-teaching model, which ensures that you get the most experience teaching in front of a live classroom before you graduate. All right, welcome to the Administration Building. Just up these steps is President Slaybach's office. If you have any questions for him, feel free to ask. He actually has an open door policy. On the top floor, we have the trifecta of offices every student needs to know about. We have the financial aid office, we have the cashier's office, and we have the registrar's office. So welcome to Schollmeyer. This is our Science and Technology Center. It's a part of the School of Natural and Social Sciences. All the research you see on the wall is performed by undergraduates to help prepare them for graduate level research. Here you can see one of our classrooms where the average class size is 15 and I've actually had a class as small as four people. Across the street we have Theater Wesleyan which houses our theater department. They've been having productions for over 65 years, at least two a year. To my right, we have Martin Hall, which houses our Department of Music. Inside, we have our Concert Hall, where our students practice to turn their talent into a career. So behind me, we have the McFadden Science Center, which is a part of the School of Natural and Social Sciences. Inside, you'll find our one and only lecture hall on campus, as well as departments for chemistry, biology, and computer science. Upstairs, we also have the labs that you would use in those majors. I want to thank you all for coming on this tour and I hope to see you in the fall. Rams up.